Hello, I'm Grigor, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Dublin. Today, I'm going to show you how to find the top contributors to not gateway traffic in your Amazon virtual private cloud. Let's get started. After logging into the AWS management console, navigate to the Amazon CloudWatch console. Then select Logs Insights. Select the log group for your NAT gateway from the drop down list. Select a predefined time range or choose custom to set your own time range. Here you can copy and paste the queries from the Knowledge Center article. The article link is in the video description. Add your NAT gateway private IP address and VPC CIDR. And then choose Run Query. The first query shows the instances or private IPs that send the most traffic through the NAT gateway. Repeat these steps for the next query. Choose Run Query. Here we can use this output to identify the traffic that goes to and from the instances. The next two queries can help identify the internet destinations that the instances in VPC communicate the most with, for both uploads and downloads. The output shows the top internet destinations for uploads. Repeat the same steps for the next query. Choose Run Query. The output shows the top internet destinations for downloads. Note that if you want to find the internet destinations where the instances are communicating, you must set up custom flow logs where the additional fields packet source address and packet destination fields are activated. Also, you can use the AWS CloudFormation template mentioned in the Knowledge Center article to create a CloudWatch dashboard with four log table widgets that incorporate each of the queries. Let's see how to find the same information using Amazon Athena. After logging in to the AWS Management Console, navigate to the Athena Console. Create a table in your database and then enter the name and choose Run. Here, we can copy and paste the first query from the Knowledge Center article. Add your NAT gateway private IP address and VPC CIDR. You can also apply start and end time filters. Note that Flowlog's timestamps use EPO time. The first query shows the instances that send the most traffic through the NAT gateway for a specific time range. Column 2 shows the number of bytes transferred. We can repeat the same process for the second query. Add NAT gateway private IP address and VPC CIDR. The results show the amount of traffic that goes to and from the instances. The last two queries identify the internet destinations that the instances in VPC communicate the most with for both uploads and downloads. Replace the placeholders as appropriate. The output shows the top internet destinations for uploads. Let's proceed with the second query for downloads. The output shows the most common internet IPs for downloads. So now you know how to find the top contributors to not gateway traffic in your Amazon VPC. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.